The dictionary definition for cyborg is that it's a science fiction term. It was until now. That means part human and part machine. And the part machine has to be physically integrated into your body and operated with your brain in order to achieve cyborgness. And mine is osseo integrated and multifunctional and it uses pattern recognition software to read the signals from my brain. When I have my arm on, I am a cyborg. Basically, the hand is gonna do whatever I'm thinking. And the way it knows what I'm thinking, this arm bracelet right here has sensors in each of these. What these sensors do is they send the signal from my brain. When I think open hand, it measures the nerves, the nerve impulses, the tiny, tiny electro, tiny, tiny electrical signals that your brain sends. If I think open hand, basically it takes a pattern of muscles to open your hand. Each of these sensors has a color on the screen there. And you can see when I'm relaxed, it's doing nothing at all. But when I thought open my hand, you can see how the red surged, the orange surged, the green kind of did a little bit. When I thought close my hand, I got kind of wider patterns in all of these, but not those big surges like open my hand. And basically what it does is it teaches my, my brain teaches the hand that this means relax, this means open hand, this means closed hand. And when I take this off and move these, I have to recalibrate it and tell it which sensor is in which location. And those are the four grips that I have so far, pronate, supinate, open, and close. So now I've taught it, that's what it feels like when the sensors are in this position and she pronates, supinates, open, and close.